Are you looking to start automating your smart home but just aren't sure where to start? Well, don't worry about it because in today's video, we're gonna be covering three easy smart home routines for beginners, so stay tuned. Hey everybody, welcome back to another video. My name is Steve from the YouTube channel Steve Does and I wanna thank you for joining me here at reviews.org. So there's a pretty good chance that one of these guys right here has snuck into your house. These are the Amazon Echo Dots. We've got the third gen and the new fourth gen one here. But are you utilizing them to their full potential? Now my experience is that most people ask it to play music, maybe ask for the weather, but other than that, that's pretty much it. But there is so much more you can do with these devices as far as controlling your smart home and that is going to be setting up routines. Now routines are essentially setting up a bunch of commands into one command. So for example, if I want to say, play music, and then I also say, turn on the lights, and then I also say, adjust the thermostat, and I can also say maybe, lock the door. Now it's gonna take me a while to go through the steps for each one, asking each individual one from these devices, but I can set up one routine that potentially is good morning or start my day and it's going to run through all four of those things for me so I don't have to do them individually. That is how we are going to set up automation on these devices and I'm going to show you three easy routines that we can set up in today's video. But before we get started, don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on future videos like this one. With that said, let's get started. All right, because this is a beginner video, we're gonna start out with something pretty simple, and that is a good morning routine. Now with a good morning routine, you could do things like wake up to an alarm or music, turn your smart lights on, adjust your smart thermostat, start the coffee, and also get a news briefing. Now keep in mind to run all of these commands, we do need additional smart home products, whether it be smart lighting, smart plugs, smart thermostats. These do have to be devices that do connect with your Amazon Alexa devices. But once you get all of those integrated into these devices, you can set up routines like that. In fact, I'm gonna show you guys a demo of setting up a good morning routine. So what we're gonna do is we're going to grab our phones. I'm gonna load up my Amazon Alexa app right here. In the very bottom right corner, we see the more option. So I'm gonna click on that. And then it looks like the fifth one down, we see routines. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on routines. And most likely these are gonna be mostly blank for you. These are ones that I've created myself. But in the very top right corner, we see the plus sign. I'm gonna go ahead and click on the plus sign. So here we are going to create our first routine. I'm gonna go ahead and enter a name for my routine. So it's gonna be Good morning. I'm gonna click on the next button. And we're gonna say when this happens. So for me, I want my good morning routine to start when my alarm goes off. So I'm gonna click on schedule up in the top. I'm gonna to say at a time. Let's do it five days this week. We'll say at a time. And I want mine to go off when I wake up in the morning. So we'll say 5.30 a.m. is when this is going to kick off. So we have that set, I'm gonna click next again. So we've got the time set. Now we're gonna pick our actions. So we're gonna click on actions. And the first thing that I want it to do is I want it to, I want it to tell me some good news. So we're gonna click on good news, click on next. So it's gonna wake me up to that. We're gonna click on the add action again. And I'm gonna scroll down all the way to where it says smart home. So tap on smart home, I'm gonna click on lights, and I'm gonna go down to the light that I have next to my bed, which is the Philips Hue light. Actually, Philips Hue 2 is on my side. I'm gonna click next again, click on power. I want it to power on, and brightness, I want it to start at 0% and slowly ramp up over, we'll say 10 minutes here. So it's slowly gonna get brighter over the first 10 minutes of that alarm going off. Now what I want it to do, Go ahead and click on the plus sign again. I want it to also turn on the heater in my house. So I'm gonna go back down here to smart home. Up at the very top, it says all devices right above lights. I'm gonna click on all devices and I'm gonna to go to my Ecobee thermostat. So what I want it to do is I want it to adjust my thermostat to about 74 is what we like it at in the morning. So we're gonna adjust 70, eh, 75 looks good. 
gonna click on next. So we also have that adjusted, and then let's say I want it to also start my coffee pot. And I have my coffee pot plugged into a smart plug. So we're gonna click on plus one more time. I'm gonna go down to smart home again, all devices, and let's see, I've got my wise kitchen light down here. We're gonna say I just want it to turn my smart plug on, which is then going to start my coffee pot. So I've got all of that set up. Oh, and one more thing. Once it runs through that routine, I also want it to start playing music. So let's go to music and podcasts. Let's go ahead and just say top 40. So we'll say play top 40 music for me, click on next again, and it is going to run through in this order that I have set up. If I want to adjust the order, so let's say I want it to play the music before it reads me my good news. I can adjust that by the two dashes that I see on either side. So for good news, I see the two dashes on the right. I'm gonna click on hold on that and it's going to allow me to adjust the order of this routine. But I want it to play me the news before my music so that all looks good to me. Look up at the top starting at 5.30 a.m choose the device that I want. So I want it to use my Echo Show 5 because that's the one that's right next to my bed. So it's gonna play all of that stuff from that device. And then I'm just gonna click on Save. Routine successfully saved. So we have it all right there. If you look at the very top where it says Good Morning, if I want to test it out, I can go ahead and click on the Play button. It's gonna run through all of that stuff on my device and get it all set up. So now that you have an idea of how to set up a routine and what is involved with it, let me go ahead and give you two other options for routines that you can set up. All right, the next easy routine that you can set up is leaving for work. So your phone can also be a geolocation device. And what that means is it's going to track where your phone is located and if you go outside a small perimeter around your house, it's going to notice that and it's going to say you've left the house and trigger certain things to happen. So if we take a look at what I have set up, I'm still in my routines menu. Third one down from the top, I've got Steve's, Steve's device leaving the house. I'll go ahead and click on that. And what I have set up is that when it detects that my phone has left the invisible perimeter around my house, which is called geofencing, it is going to set my thermostat to 85 because I don't want my air to be running while I'm not home. And it's also gonna turn off every light in my house. Now, some additional things that you can do with this, I just don't have these in my house right now, is you can also have it lock any smart locks that you have around the house. So if you've got one on your front door, it can make sure that that is automatically locked. You can also have it do something like turn on your robot vacuum and vacuum the house while you're gone, or even close the garage door if you have a smart garage door opener. So there are a lot of things that you can program into a routine like this when you leave the perimeter of your house. All right, now the last easy routine that I have for beginners is a good night routine. So with a good night routine, you could do things like make sure the front door is locked, turn off all the lights in the house, maybe adjust the thermostats to a different temperature. But what I have set up for my good night routine is I actually use it for my kids. So I'm gonna go ahead and load up the phone right here. We're back in the routine menu. And if we scroll all the way down to the bottom, I've got one at the very bottom that says good night. So when I say good night in my daughter's room to the Echo device, what it's going to do is it's going to turn on her fan because she likes a little bit of white noise. So we have a smart plug that's gonna turn on that fan. And we also have it play lullabies from Pandora for one hour. So what's nice about that is that I don't have music playing all throughout the night. It's gonna go on for just a one hour timer. Usually by then she's asleep on a good night and then that'll just turn itself off and the fan will stay on till the next morning when we automatically turn it off. Well, those are some simple routines that you can do with the Amazon Echo devices. This was just kind of a getting started guide to automating your home. If this is something that you like, hit that thumbs up button and let us know that you liked it because if so, we will do more videos like this. If you guys have other automation ideas that you like, leave them in the comments below. If you wanna know more about these devices, take a look at the link below to reviews.org. If you guys wanna see more from me, check out my YouTube channel, Steve Does, where I do a lot of cool tech reviews. If this video is helpful, give it a thumbs up. Let me know that you liked it. 
As always, I want to thank you for joining me here at reviews.org, and I will see you guys in the next video.